Hey guys, what's going on? It's Mr. Brown here, and welcome back to my playthrough of Final Fantasy VII Remake. In the previous episodes, we have just been doing side quests. I did end up finishing up all the Chapter 8 side quests here in the Sector 5 Swims. If you want to go check those videos out, they will be on the channel. So if you guys need some help with them, just go ahead and take a look at them. They're fairly simple. I don't think you need videos to do them, but if you do need extra help on how to defeat some of the enemies, I show and explain throughout my battles how I did it. So, not too difficult. And we also got the new summoning materia. Um, I'm actually going to equip it on Aerith right now, which is Shiva. That video will also be on the channel for you guys to figure out how to beat her as well. But Fire, if you can tell already would is like your best friend during that fight so it's so, fine right, so now we're ready to go start the main story mission as well if you remember from the i think it was the first or second side quest episode we got a tip off that um someone was heading towards Aerith's house in a black suit so most likely another turk so we are going to head back to Aerith's house now and see what the heck is going on so if you guys don't remember where her house is so there seems to be the guy in the suit already so that was quick I'm actually gonna gear up real quick because I believe you have to fight him so I'm just basically just gonna put the iron blade back on um, I should be fine keeping these on besides this one maybe and maybe fire I might take fire off and put on cure because I don't know if Aerith is going to be in this fight or not so um, better safe than sorry I still am not using items didn't use items throughout the um side quest episodes either so just an fyi um hmm sometimes i to put auto cure on i mean it is already max level so i guess we don't really need it i'm just trying to think of things to level up while we have some time to level things up i think we got all of our at least um spell material up to the second level at least besides wind but I don't really see a use for wind honestly so just gonna put on barrier just to have it on there I guess and I'll throw another HP up material on there just to you know boost my health even more so yeah all right let's go ahead and see what he's up to Hello, Aerith. What do you want? Haven't seen him before. He your new boy toy? He's my bodyguard, if you must know. Wait a minute. Those eyes. Is he the one who beat up Reno? And what if I am? Need to cross my T's, dot my I's, that's all. Cloud, leave him be. Rude's not a bad person, really. No, I'm not bad. But like it or not, I sometimes have to do bad things. <sighs> Don't take it personal. You Turks are all the same. Huh? All bark, no bite. You're one to talk. Alright. So, looks like we do have to fight oh, Rude here. So. <laughs> Stay back. so. Damn, he punches quick. <clears throat> Jesus. I was expecting that. Um, I will get an assess. Oh, okay, he's really quick. I'll get an assess here in a second. I thought it would be just a lonely battle with, without Aerith. But, apparently not. No. Um, so we'll see what he's about. Best do it right. Um, wind is his weakness, of course. I didn't put it on there. He's uh, lesser resistance to fire. So if you guys do have the wind material, go ahead and put it on because it will rapidly fill his stagger gauge. I didn't know that, so I don't think wind's all that useful in the game, but I guess it's something to level up. So he's a uh, operative with the Turk unit of Shinra, General Affairs Division, as he possesses incredible strength and well-toned physique. 
He prefers using his fist over weapons. Which you can obviously tell. Go on. No holding back. Gotta get a little payback with my partner. I think we can still fill his tiger gauges by hitting him, so again it looks like triple slash is gonna be your best friend and chain as many attacks as possible. But also I think just using spells on him will work as well. My turn. See how well fire works. Fire didn't do a lot, but first class. But he has um lesser resistance to a to fire, but that's fine. I'm gonna go ahead and cure up real quick. Come on. So he's gonna come quickly. <laughs> I'm coming. Okay. Did he just chuck me? Is that what he did? Why don't you lead the way? Chuck me. That's that's nice. Um, I would assume he's kind of maybe like Reno, where you block his attacks, you might dagger him, or not. Uh, maybe disorder might be good. Kind of switch into Go on. um. The Punisher mode quick area, this should stagger him. So, and switch to the next phase of the battle. So. Okay then. <laughs> so, you had enough yet? No. I don't believe that I have. So don't I'm gonna overdo it. Switch so to Aerith and it. use prayer to heal yeah, up Cloud because we don't have job. anything to heal up at then the moment. Think about so. changing careers. Okay, he's, yeah. he's hitting the ground and fire. But I do have my limit break, so I'm gonna go ahead and just use You're it. So it should do quite a bit of damage. On you. I'll take care of him. Cloud's pretty strong, isn't he? And then I'm gonna heal while he's down. You've seen his type before. You don't know me. Okay. So he does hit quite a he does quite a, hit quite hard. But not like hard hard to where it's How's that pain? I'd throw this down. Can you take over oh. for me? Better than expect. I'm just tired. Oh, he's putting us to sleep now, that's nice. Oh, I guess even being bound doesn't matter. At least he'll still throw us. Or blocking, not. Yeah. Might have been a bad time to use that. She's still taking a nap, yeah. I thought you didn't want to get rough. No, but this is self-defense. So of course wind would probably be really helpful. But I didn't put it on, like I said, a second ago. Get ready. I would have thought dodging would have helped, but like or at least like disrupt his attacks, but it really doesn't. Unfortunately. Take the lead. Switch the air. Get in the little circle here. Use fire. Doesn't do a lot, but it it does. This is gonna hurt. Hurt a bit. One more. So I can get a couple of attacks in. Here we go. Zombie. There we go. We countered that one pretty well. Um, we'll go ahead and use triple slash again. No, we're not. Shit. Seems like Aerith is just a little bit to window him down a bit while we're just slugging it out. Seems to be what happens because he doesn't really go after her. Interesting. Even if he plays, I don't know if he'll go after her. Good. Just trying to put us to sleep. It looks like is that just gonna follow us? Can we put himself to sleep? That's that's terrible. Okay, go, let's go turn. away. That, I was gonna say, there's no way that's just gonna stick around the whole time. This order seems to work pretty well as well. To kind of disrupt him a bit. But, but how to get this order, you have to use the nail bat that Oats gives you in the at the end of the um, shorter kids on patrol side quest, so. Little FYI there. Please, just leave us alone. You know I can't do that. <sighs> hey there, partner. Uh, I'm but, sure you're having the time of your uh, life, but we're needed on standby uh, for a job. It's something uh, about Sector 7. Uh, so get your ass back here now. 
Understood. Got somewhere else to be? Apparently so. Go home and stay there. You know I can't do that. Huh? Well, that was just an ass kicking, but that's okay. Do we go home now? So I want to point out in the, um, I think it might have been in the last main quest video or the the first side quest video, there are these things called mana scripts. And for right now, I have Clouds and Aerith's first ones because those are the characters we're using. Um, I'm want there are two more that we can get in the Moogle Emporium, so I will grind off screen for some extra Moogle medals because they cost five apiece just to get the rest of these. And we do have all the music this, besides one up to this point because I forgot it in the chapter seven, I believe it was. Oh, chapter six. I left it in a vending machine behind the big fans. So, unfortunately, we have to wait till the um, after game to get that one. Because I don't think I can go back there. Let's go ahead and head back to her house. Head back to her house and uh, see what's happening over here. Because he did tell us to go home and stay there. But wait a sec. So, you coming? Right behind you. Just slowly walking. Can't run like you, apparently. My, my legs aren't built for it. Slow down. Jesus. So I guess this is where you uh, actually find that material that I got. So, but it doesn't matter. Getting it early isn't all that helpful, I guess. It's just an MP up, I believe, is what it was. You talking to the shh. So yeah, it was that kind of day. <sighs> Let's go. Shouldn't keep mom waiting. Hey, what'd they say? Good work today, guys. Kidding. They didn't say a word. But, you know... Uh, never mind. It's not like you'd believe me, after all. Hmm. Probably not. Tell me anyway. Really? Yeah. It won't be much longer now. The flowers, they... They have something important to tell us. Something they... Need to share with us. At least, that's the feeling I get. But, before they can, there's a final step that has to be taken. Otherwise, we won't hear them. Maybe I should just give up. Honestly, it's what I do best. Could have fooled me. From what I've seen, you're no quitter. Well, today's special. That's why I've been working my butt off. Uh, what's so special about it? <laughs> okay, time to go. What the heck do you mean, it's time to go? We're having a heartfelt conversation. Learn to talk to her. Yeah, you tell those flowers. Did the flowers say anything? Uh, good work today, guys? <laughs> That's the spirit. Nice, we're talking to flowers now. Fantastic. Alright. 
You're heading in already? Uh, so I'm guessing this is to make sure that we've done everything up to this point, which we have. So I'm just going to go ahead and say yeah. Yeah, that's enough for one day. Where have you two been? Uh, I've been worried sick. Sorry, we got a little sidetracked. Dinner's ready, in case you're wondering. Ah, great. But before we sit down, I want you to make up the guest room. Gotcha. Take a load off, okay? Judging by those eyes, I'm guessing you're a soldier. Ex-soldier. I hate to ask, but would you leave tonight without any fuss, no questions? You boys made a trade, a normal life, for power. You can't have it both ways. I'm back! Good! <sighs> now, I hope you're hungry. Starving, right? Uh. I've never been so proud. The man you've become? Women must be hounding you day and night. Not really. You know, there's all kinds of temptations in the big city. I'd feel a lot better if I knew you'd found a good girl. One who'd make sure you didn't get into trouble. I can take care of myself. An older, more mature girl. I could keep you on the straight and narrow. And tell you when you're being a silly goose. That's the perfect type for you, I'd say. <sighs> hmm. Don't want to overstay my welcome. Well, it seems like we've had our fun with Aerith for now. It's time to get back on the normality. Go back to Sector 7, I guess. Uh, sneaking out. Try, not, try to sneak out of the house without letting Aerith spot you. Be careful not to bump into anything by accident. Aerith will notice if you make too much noise. And of course, they put obstacles in the on the floor for you to run into. You're telling me I barely bump it. It's gonna make that much of a noise? It? Jeez. Uh, uh, nothing. Did you have a bad dream? Don't worry. You'll feel much better in the morning. And I promise to take you straight home. Uh, okay. All right, so literally don't. You can't even, like, touch it. That was all part of the plan. Just wanna uh, show you what it looks like. Please with don't let her hear me again. There, if you get caught, this time I'll do it for real. <laughs> Hopefully. It's like impossible. It's not impossible by any means. As it moves the cameras and it screws me up. Gosh, you darn jerk! It. Oh, what the I hell? I thought I told you not to leave your room. Now get back in there. Okay. Now I'm curious just to go through all the voice lines just to see how many times I can get insulted. I'm avoiding that one on the camera angle. <sighs> see if she can insult me again if I mess up. I just don't like how they make this... They just make it difficult by putting shit in the way. Why can't you just... Oh, okay. Well, it looks like with the third time, they moved some things, because they're like, this is enough. You're <laughs> struggling too much. You're leaving? So, how do I get to Sector 7? It's simple enough. Just cut through Sector 6. It isn't exactly safe, but you should be okay, seeing as you're a soldier. Was one. Promise me, you'll never talk to Aerith again. Please. You got it. Thank you. Wow. Well... Nice knowing her. <laughs> Just 
never having to talk to her again. That's wow. I'm not gonna say it's a bitch move, but nah, she's just looking out for her daughter. It's okay. I understand. At least we get to see what the slums look like at night. But the sky and the plate about oh, the half a plate, I guess. This part doesn't have much of a plate. It does, but not a lot. Go to sleep. If it isn't the new florist, I appreciate you helping the kids out today. Thank you. They won't stop talking about the soldier who saved the day. Oh, and make sure to give my thanks to Aerith, too. Sure. Probably won't be doing that, but... I'm not supposed to talk to her again. So it's fine. So it looks like we head out from the right side up here. Wow. Back to Sector 7 it is. Oh. Well, look who it is. Talk about a coincidence. What are you doing here? Waiting. Why? Because I'm not sick of you yet. <sighs> <laughs> Lead on then. With pleasure. <laughs> Cloud? Is something wrong? It's nothing. Alright. So apparently we're not leaving Aerith behind. She was smart enough to come and find us. Or trick us i guess or hide and wait for us to leave because she knew apparently but this is chapter nine now we are finally out of chapter eight and away from sector five slums but hopefully before we get we can fully leave i could go grind for those moogle medals and grab the um two other manuscripts hopefully i hope i can still get over here during the nighttime. so do the moogle emporium stuff and there's a spot uh, apparently we can't because it's blocked off Gramps so I hope at some point we'll be able to come back here and do that which I think we should be able to later on in the game I think after chapter 9 we will be able to um so yeah if you guys did enjoy this episode please be sure to let me know down in the comments below or simply just by leaving a like on the video helps as well um I'm, I am really enjoying playing the game for a second time with the added challenge of trying to die and not using items we have racked up a lot of items that we can't use without purchasing any which i'm surprised about 94 potion that's a lot for not using items midway through the game so it's fantastic with only one death so far so i'm really proud of myself for that one so if you guys want to stick around and watch the rest of the series to come please be sure to hit the subscribe button down below and yeah thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you in the next one